All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. We're here with another part of this Red Dead Redemption walkthrough. Um, we're back here in Armadillo, and I think we're literally about to start the, uh, I guess, assault on Fort Mercer. The next mission is Marshall Johnson right next to Fort Mercer, so I assume we're going to start it. No other missions have popped up. Uh, between parts, I did do a bounty. Um, I did look it up, and the American Appetites should respawn eventually. From what I see, I hope that's the case. I really want to get that outfit. Wait, what's this? What is this one at the theater right here? Lights, camera, action. That's something else. Okay, so we're gonna head straight to uh, Fort Mercer over here. Marshall Johnson, we'll carry off with the assault on Fort Mercer. I know we're. I don't know how far into the game this is. I, I, we're probably not even a quarter into the game yet. I have no clue for sure. Um, you might notice that my horse is different. Because it's literally on my last bounty run, just before I started filming here. Uh, I killed the bounty target. It was one of the Ballard Twins gang. Uh, it was a member of the Ballard Twins gang. And literally, I was running off-road, off, off the path, and the horse just dropped dead. I don't know what happened. Not even, like, depleted stamina or anything. I didn't run it excessively. I just hopped back on, and it just dropped dead. It was just, what? What kind of nonsense is that? the beautiful horse I had Let's go. and that happens if you can't tell I'm slightly salty it's just a cool looking horse like the kind of tan and white mix either way I just picked up a new one from the bounty target himself uh, <laughs> I, I hate that I really I dislike that I'd go and attach to that horse at this point okay so uh, this this time right here I won't um, Whatever mission is next, I've realized I don't need to run around the whole map anymore. Like, I have a lot of locations discovered. So why am I trying to... Why am I trying to run on the horse everywhere when I could just set up a campsite outside of the settlement and fast travel there? It's just so much better. I don't know why I haven't been doing this. But uh, I'm going to start doing that from now on. I think it only works for places you've discovered, maybe? I think it's something like that. So I'll have to work on that, but... I should be able to do that. Discover places and just start fast traveling. Not, no more of this horse trips 3,000 miles across the map. Okay, let's start this. John, Marshal, gentlemen, <clears throat> uh -huh. Uh -huh. it's time, we must go. Why, what's happening? Seth has managed to get himself inside, <laughs> but we can't leave it too long or they will soon realize how very curious he is and remove him from the premises. Or slit his throat and watch him bleed to death. But for a minute, he will delight and amuse them. That's when he'll get us inside. Okay. Marshals of the law, when the shooting starts, take that as your cue to start awarding each other medals. Hmm? I mean, take that as a cue to get inside and clean up the mess. Oh. The gang's all here. All this I care is about sick. is Williamson. It is vital we stop him. Agreed. Is there gonna be that some horse chase? Stone cold killer. Williamson's a proud fool. The question is which will win out between his pride and his instinct for survival. I'm ready for this. Let's get to it. Oh, God. that That's going to be my thumbnail right there. Straight off the bat. That's sick. The gang's all here. We got the sheriffs and our marshal and deputies. And then we got oh, a freaking Escunch Gatling gun in the back. In the back of my wagon, John, so that we can make our grand entrance. It's so cool. Okay. I'm in love with this. Seth is inside. Where's what, what's Irish doing? Is he is he gonna take part or is he just gonna hang back like a coward? Come on, let's go. Oh, they're getting in the wagon too. That's oh no, no they're not. Just me. All right, good. Now just stay put till I tell you otherwise. 
That scoundrel Seth had better not let us down. Seth, Once I actually trust most, I honestly. Our adversaries into a false sense of security with some beguiling sales pattern. I will give you the signal. What signal? The moment you hear a sharp rap on the side of the wagon, rise like the phoenix and start shooting like you've never shot before. I can do that. This is it, my dear boy. The moment of truth. Me and you, John. One last time into the breach. This is, is Nigel going to make it out of this? Of my life. I hope my nerves don't get the better of me. I'll be honest with you, John. I'm a little jittery. John? John? It reeks of miracles back here. Thank God. Now I'll be ready with that machine gun, my dear boy. I'll be a sitting duck in there. I was going to say, is he going to make it through this? Because I don't see a way he's not in any armored plating like I am. So hopefully he survives this. I actually kind of like Nigel. He's he's not a good crazy, but he's he's entertaining. Hey, yeah. <laughs> come on in, come on in. Welcome to my humble abode. <laughs> come on. <laughs> see, see, Seth is just yeah. absolutely batshit. Sorry, excuse my language. Greetings, my good man. But he's actually yeah. useful. What would you say if I said immortality was at hand? What would you say if I told you I could teach you to fly? <laughs> what would you say if I told you I could turn a man into a beautiful woman? <laughs> Impossible, yes, once, but no more. Gentlemen, I bring you wisdom from the East. I have here in this wagon some of the finest goods, the best oh, medicines, to light up. and the newest inventions available for you and your families. Exotic trinkets from the far reaches of the earth, elixirs that give vigor and strength. <laughs> and uh, for you men of physical skill and athletic physique, uh, this miraculous elixir can keep the muscles supple and relax the cords. It loosens the joints and gives a feeling of vigor and freshness to the whole system. Why, some men have reported to me that after drinking it for one month, they can chew through steel. <laughs> Oh, this is all. Oh, this is what I signed up for right here. Now, John. Now. What else we got? This is a nightmare. Is there more of you? Do I have unlimited ammo? Cause I love this. Can I loot all these guys, please? Where's Bill at? Fucking dang pig! Them cocksucking some bitches escaped the other side of the fort. All right, let's go. Okay. All right, boys, let's finish them. Damn you! I'm not even gonna worry about looting. I can make money later. Doesn't matter. I think my work here is done. Godspeed, he pulls the door on your way out. Move forward. Let me go to a, a repeater here. Wait, what? How am I supposed to prevent them from dying? Really? Oh, that's kind of BS. Let's go! Dude, it's kind of hard to prevent them from being stupid. I think my work here is done! Godspeed, gentlemen. Oh, please don't make me have to run through this a couple times just because the deputies are dumb.
You're already getting hit a couple times. Who do you think you are? Give me some cover, partner! Shit, there's more of them! God damn it, there's more of them! How'd the marshal get down there? Oh, you you just teleported for sure. That's the last of them. We still can't find Williamson anywhere. Oh, he escaped. Hey, it's the snake oil guy. Caroline, let me in for goodness sake. The fool must be hiding. Man, it is time to start tearing this place apart and find out where he's cowering. You got sense of urgency here, please. Open the gate. It's the snake oil guy. What Get the, the goddamn gate open and lock it behind him. Oh, Bill is Bill is gonna be out there. Oh, we've got company, gentlemen. Oh, we gotta hold the fort now, don't we? Reinforcements riding this way. Oh my good lord above. There must be a hundred of them. Oh, this is what I'm talking about. Can I get the get the Gatling gun on the gate? Eh, it's not too bad. I could take him. Oh, we're outside now. Okay, that's an explosive wagon. To say, can I blow up another explosive wagon? Okay, I shot so many bullets at that guy. Where's Bill at, though? Bill ain't here. We looked everywhere. Oh, hold on! Oh, hold on! I Marston. Oh, you coward! Marston, we got a live one. He says. Bill's already run off to Mexico yesterday. Oh, of morning. course he has. <laughs> You'll never get him. Javier Escuela. He's gone to see Javier Escuela. That should make things interesting. So we're heading to we're Mexico? In Mexico. How should I know? Oh! <laughs> we're in Mexico, you little shit! <laughs> Some place near Chuparos, I think he said. <laughs> Bandit country. Chupa feckin' Rosa. Oh, I'll take you there, John. I'm real popular down there. You just meet me at the ferry. I've got lots of friends down south. I'll see you at the ferry, Irish. And just get me things. I'm sorry about this, John. I guess you'll be heading to Mexico. So it would seem. How is it down there? Wonderful. A sweet, peace-loving people with the love of social justice. May you always find coin in your pocket. It's been a pleasure spending time with you, boy. You too, Mr. West Dickens. Marshal? All right, boys. That's enough. So are they are they are they just keeping control of Fort Mercer? I mean that would be smart to be fair, but uh, I guess we're going to Mexico. Irish is gonna be somehow useful here. Hopefully not abandon us. Ooh, assaults on Fort Mercer. Okay. Irish. Oh, he's way down there. Is that a bad guy? I was really hoping there'd be a like a. Some place you could rent to have a property in the fort. That would be sick. Okay, let me uh, set a waypoint here. Where is the... What is that place? Oh, that's uh, rentable property in plain view. Wait, is this...
Is it part of the same map? It might be. I, I thought it would be a different map, but this actually <laughs> straight up might be Mexico down here. Okay. So this is a lot of frontier justice going on here. Ooh, there's a lot of people to loot here. Real quick. Just take a second. That's a lot of money to pass by. And ammo. This ain't nice. I know. Oh my lord. Yeah, it's too much to pass up. Okay. And good ammo. Whenever we get to Mexico, I'm gonna have to find a gunsmith somewhere. See if uh, see if there's any more weapons I can unlock. Cause I know there's still like a buff buffalo rifle available. I'm pretty sure, and I assume there's more coming. But I should have enough money to buy them at the very least. So just need to find out when they unlock, or if you have to do a challenge to unlock them. Oh, it's horses. Okay, well I'll take this pelt and everything. I can sell that. You stink. Actually, once we finish this final one, I might see uh, how close this is to the waypoint for Irish is to Thieves Landing. Because I might just try to fast travel to Thieves Landing. Why not? Let's take a look at the map right here after I pick him. How close is it? Thieves Landing is pretty close. Or just go to McFarland's Ranch. Actually, I think it'd be better to just stick where we're at. Because I don't know if there's a way down from here. No, it looks like there is from McFarland's Ranch. Yeah, we're going to fast travel to McFarland's Ranch. Let me set up the kit, improved campsite that I bought. Ah, oh, dude, I knew it was going to be too close. Get a little further away and we'll try again. Oh, Rio Bravo. Might, be, might work now. There we go. So we'll fast travel to McFarland's Ranch, and we could head straight down. It's at least a, a closer trip than uh, anywhere else. McFarland's... There it is. At least a closer trip. Save some time. Come on, horse. Okay, this works. I don't know when it's supposed to happen, but some of the, uh, like that strange request I'm trying to do for the outfit, it should respawn. Um, hopefully, it, whatever takes place in Mexico isn't, like, insanely long so I can come back and do this mission. Maybe I could probably just fast travel back off camera and do it then. Good coyotes. You can go down. Okay, perfect. Go. All I was worried about. Dude, they need to have a race down here because this is a perfect alleyway. Little t funnel to uh, down bottom here. Perfect place for a race. Ferry right here. Yes, it is. Okay. I'm really excited to finish this campaign and go on to Undead Nightmare. Because Undead Nightmare, I had honestly more fun doing Undead Nightmare than the main campaign. And the freaking main campaign for this is really good. There's constant moments where it just makes me makes me laugh the whole time. Oh, Nigel's here too. Nice. interesting fellow, Mr. Irish. Ah, oh, Mr. Marston. I've come to wish you well. How are you, sir? I'm okay. It seems that our friend Mr. Irish here is well connected south of the border. Oh, it's true. Uh, they love me down there. It's like a second home. I've got more friends than you could shake a stick at, should you so desire. So you know the way. Oh, it's easy. We just get on me raft here and let the current sweep us away to paradise. Come on then, Dobby. I'm not sure your idea of paradise and mine are quite the same, Irish. Relax, we'll have a great time and we'll find your man Williamson no bother. I hope so. Hey, come on now. Look at it this way. I know we ain't exactly old pals, but, you know, have I ever done you wrong? No, 
but not through lack of trying. Hey! Well, you boys have fun down there. I shall miss you, John Marston. Thank you. Where are you headed? Oh, you know me? Oh, uh, London or Paris or, uh, or maybe Peking. I'm a traveling man, sir. This land is much too small for the likes of me. <laughs> Well, try not to get yourself killed. Oh, well, yes, we men of science are not a very loved bunch in this land of myth and superstition. I'm off to the civilized world where men like myself are revered and given medals. Ha! Hmm. Have fun. The same to you, sir. The same to you. <laughs> Nice of you to turn up for once, Irish. What do you mean? In usual fashion, you conveniently missed all the action of Fort Mercer. What can once I again, say? he's a coward. I woke up with me head in a pair of pits, and it felt ill-mannered not to get reacquainted with him. At least you got your priorities straight. You know me, Johnny boy. I'll be late to me own funeral. They say God invented whiskey to stop the Irish from oh, shoot. Who, who's shooting at us? Look out, bandits! There's too many of them. Cut the road. We'll drift down river. How is there too many? I can take them all. It's like, how is there too many? This is like six guys. We took on more at the fort. Dude, this dude's insanely accurate. Oh really? Thank you. I just had to reload for a second. You know who I am. Dude, I, at least I'm accurate with the rifles in this game. Honestly, I, I hate to say it sometimes, but the combat in this game is absolutely easy mode. And he has dynamite. That's fantastic. Did I take him out? I can't tell. Look left, on top of the cliff. You want to go wrong? It wasn't me. You really want to die? This ain't exactly the reception I was expecting. It was the one I was, one I was expecting. Over there. Got the handle on you. What the hell did you do to these fellas? I recall it was something to do with the money. Possibly something to do with the money. I should take out two at a time there? You're gonna leave this in a box! Bloody Nara! Ooh, there are so many people here. Dude, there's so many people. Oh yeah, combat in this game is absolutely easy mode. I didn't, I didn't choose hardcore. I guess I shouldn't complain too much. I did pick normal difficulty instead of hardcore. No more gunfights? Come on, bring bring more guys. The lassies do. Oh, the big brown eyes turn stone into butter. They would. And the Mexicans know how to make a bottle of liquor too. What that poke? Wait, what? I want a Springfield rifle. When I get this? Oh, you gotta have some fun. I'm just here for Bill Williamson. Well, I'm glad to be back. This place is a wild devil's paradise. Apart from the fellers trying to kill you. Down here, they call me El Rato. The cat, on account of cunning. I'm pretty sure ratto means rat, my friend. <laughs> I like it though. Okay. A little more inventive than Irish. Well, you Americans never were very creative with your use of language, was you, John Marston? 
Hey, by the way, we totally fucked up the ferry for every other person in across the border here. <laughs> we just ruined it for everybody else. I just love that. I like this Springfield rifle. I don't know where I got it from, though. It does work very good. I haven't stepped foot in this country, and they're already trying to kill me. Well, you really need to stop patronizing with your favorite Let's go, uh, no aiming here, or no lock on. Let's actually just do some regular scoping. I love, I love that joke. Pretty sure Ratto means rat there, friend. <laughs> what do we got? Watch your top deck clip. They're shooting down on us. Really, I didn't see them. Yeah, I don't know where I got this Springfield, but I like it. Uh, maybe I got it at the fort. I can't remember. I don't think I bought it. It's awfully close. What is that? You tell me. You must have been called it a few times. Are we getting into some rapids here? Yeah, there's, I've, I've shot like 75 people here at this point. Let's go ahead and reload. Said they got him. Is there more? I'll miss these escapades, Johnny boy. I really will. I doubt you'll remember any of it, Irish. Another, another fair point. Oh, is this There's where we're getting off? Up on the left. Hang on, we'll be on dry land soon. God damn it! There's another two. Good night. Another penny out of me. We made There we go. More ammo. Hard. Am I glad to be getting out of that floating death trap? <laughs> These horses look fresher! <laughs> no, give me the white one. And healthy! No, oh, don't do that. That's nasty. These poor fools any further. Tell me where I'm headed. Of course, of course. Let me think. You do know people down here. Aside from your friends who welcomed us on the way. Yes, I think so. <laughs> I was real drunk last time I was here, John. You know how it is. I, I met an American guy, uh, uh, saw him shoot a man, uh, drank with him in the village of Chuparosa. Funny guy! <laughs> uh, or was that Canada? No, that was Canada. Guy here, not funny, but he's real nice. Uh, failing that, uh, you could try the provincial governor, uh, Colonel something or other, some Spanish name. He's based out of Escalera. Uh, played three card stud with him. Or was it four card Monty? I forget. He was a real nice chap. Or maybe he was a real bastard. <laughs> I was real drunk last time, John. <laughs> well, thanks a lot for your help. Oh, let me guess. You gotta be on your way. <sighs> the famed hospitality isn't what it once was. And I've never been known to overstay me welcome. So off I go to greener pastures. Good luck, John. You're an angry and a fat, ugly man. But not a bad one. <laughs> yeah, the guy that literally is tied for ugliest with Seth that I've met so far calls me ugly. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's go for it. Okay. Missions are do we have here? Oh, that's stats. I don't want where's map. There we go. So what do we have available? What's LR? Land and Ricketts, and then we have DeSanta. 
Uh, I guess we're just gonna go for the closest one, so Landon Ricketts. Why not? Ooh, Irish's shack. Wait, where was that at? Where's Irish? I don't I don't see it anywhere. Oh. Oh, it must be this one way down here. Okay. We're not gonna worry about that for the time being then. New items are available for purchase. So if Landon Ricketts is in a town, I'll definitely go on a, a shopping spree here. Step in front of a runaway train. We got a freaking soundtrack too. What the heck? To again. I really hope this is not copyrighted music. <laughs> this is gonna screw me over for YouTube here if this is. Is it, now that I think about it, it, doesn't matter too much. I'm not monetized on YouTube. <laughs> Nourished horse? Like, what is that? It's like a zombie horse. I'm gonna lasso that thing. Yeah, let's go for it. Let's see if I can save the horse. It looks so malnourished. Let's go ahead and save it. You'll be my new horse. I got you now. Calm down now. Come on, baby. Calm down. I'm totally come winning on, this. Come on, come on. Come on. There we go. Come you're on, my, you're my new guy. horse. Looked like a zombie horse there for a second. Okay, let's uh, let's give you an apple. Horse is not hungry. Okay. You're a little slower. I think that's mainly because you are insanely malnourished. But you're my new horse. Why is John Marston hovering off the horse? I think it's... I think the, the actual model is supposed to be a little healthier than this. Oop, supposed to go that way. I think it's uh, kind of making him hover a little bit. <laughs> you see the gap between the horse and John. Yeah, I feel bad for the horse. Baranka? Baranka? I don't know how to pronounce these names. The horse is quite a bit slower. Go. I do kind of uh, regret taking him, but also save the horse. <laughs> I say that, I, I save the horse and I immediately put him to work, dragging me across the map. I don't even know if I could have fast traveled this one. I don't know if I had the location discovered, so I don't know if that worked. I potentially could have been able to, but too late to know now. I'm already here. Back to a different weapon here. So this is Landon Ricketts. In actually a sizable fort here. Okay. Hopefully you're not a bad guy. Right off the bat. I don't want to be another Bill Williamson. I get shot and dragged but saved, saved by somebody else. Oh, this is a town. Never mind. 
Okay, this is a town. This works better. Chuparosa. Okay. Hey, gringo! Hablas español? No, sir. Pardon, pero yo habla un solo poquito español. <laughs> habla English? <laughs> oh, sí, gringo. Hablo mucho inglés. Sí. Hablo filthy fucking bean eater. Hablo slippery little Mexican. Oh. Hablo little piece of shit. shit. <laughs> Comprende, amigo? Comprende? Hey, what are you doing here, gringo? I don't remember inviting you to my country. I don't think you did, amigo. I mean you no harm. <laughs> You mean us no harm? This is funny. <laughs> what harm could you do to us? I could exactly. kill every one of you. <laughs> Don't turn Nothing. this into a John Wick moment. No, I appreciate the welcome committee. But I'd hate to spoil a beautiful afternoon on such beautiful land. Any further unpleasantries? If you'll excuse me. Uh, if you want to duel, we can duel. I think you're forgetting something. A little taxation. <laughs> I have a large family. <laughs> I too have a family, friend. So that we may see our families again, I suggest we part ways amicably. <laughs> can I see the boots, gringo? I think you can see them from where you're standing just fine, senor. Let's get to drawing pistols Take here. Off the boots, Americano. Dude. It's over for y'all if y'all want to play this game. As you wish. <laughs> hey, give the hat back. You don't mess with John's hat. Oh, very good. Very good indeed, sir. What a great way to improve border relations. Hey, they started it, man. An illiterate farmer crossing the river, coming into their civilization and butchering the local peasants. <laughs> Thank Those you look like bandits to me, sir. They're strapped. Don't mention it, old man. You kill peasants, you become a peasant. I never aspired to be anything more. <laughs> a socialist, huh? No wonder you left America. I'm many things, most of them bad, but a man of political principles? No. Well, then I fear Mexico may not be for you, sir. Don't you worry about me. Oh, but I do worry. An angry man a long way from home, a man who handles a gun as sloppy as you. Sloppy? What? I can handle what a gun. What is this okay, dude talking partner? about? Yeah, as long as you're killing quail or peasants. But if you have to face another man, you don't stand a chance. Dude, dead eye will and you do? mess you up. Can show you a few tricks. Come with me. Hold on. What's your name? You're Landon Ricketts, Canada. isn't it? And you? I never had a name, Mister. I was raised in an orphanage. <laughs> a real American. Wonderful. Just wonderful. Okay, this has to be Landon Ricketts. Okay, they totally started it first. I'm trying to steal my, steal my stuff. Well, you won't make it in the circus, but you can shoot. Keep on practicing. Thank you, old man. Now, who are you? No one interesting. Who are you? Landon Ricketts. Not a name that means much anymore. It means a little. You were famous when I was a boy. Yeah, killing men's a strange kind of fame. I was the fastest in my time. I must have been. I'm the only one left. Oh, that's... okay. What are you doing here? Living quietly. Waiting. For what? I don't know. And you? I'm looking for a couple of men. Bill Williamson, Javier Escuela. <sighs> Escuela's from here. 
It could be. This whole place is teeming with a, with Americans on the run. Mercenaries, locals hell-bent on revolution. Revolution? Another one? <sighs> yeah. Never really is. This whole place has been a hotbed for revolution since before the Spanish left. Now there's another local guy running around promising the peasants their freedom. Ah, just like the last two or three. Local government? Foul bunch. Colonel Allende, he runs this place like a feudal king. He's an awful individual. Is that so? Yeah. Until someone puts a bullet in his head. Come on, let's get back to it. You gotta keep that back straight. Otherwise, it makes the gun jump. See if this Schofield makes a difference. Now that's a real gun. Did he just give us a new gun? Schofield revolver. We have the cattleman. We have my volcanic I bought. Dear mio! I really wish right, I spoke Spanish. Let's go again. Concentrate on all three bottles at the same time. Well done. Now that wasn't so I already hard knew how to use that eye. Come on. I've got another idea. Are you on target shooting or crow the shooting? Here what? Are always raising hell. Scavenging and scaring the life out of the locals. I Ooh, say we put your newfound skills to the test while doing a public service for the good people of Chuparosa. Here we'll do. I'm gonna scare up some birds. Let's see if you can take down more than one at a time. I think that works. Nicely done, sir. You've been taught well. I have to say I'm surprised you heard of Landon Ricketts. For the love of God! What? Was it gonna shot more birds? Did I mess up his dialogue? He's not speaking. I think I messed up his dialogue. There's my horse. Where are we going to here? Senor Ricketts! Senor Ricketts! Senor Ricketts! Por favor, senor. Our back wagon's under attack just outside of town. We need your help again. Whoa, slow down, Ramon. We'll take care of it. Thank you, senor. Again, you are the savior of this town. Well, my friend, are you ready to take a less theoretical exam? Sure. sure, yes, sir. Let's Hopefully do it. I ever rode with no savior before. <laughs> Let's haul out. Time we put you to work on some bigger prey. I guess that horse is not. I guess I'm leaving the malnourished one. Okay, that kind of didn't work out the way I wanted. Let's uh, get rid of this map icon here. Long story. We used to ride together. We was all friends once. Only a buzzard feeds on his friends. There must be a high bounty on their heads. What would you do if somebody took the people you love and told you they'd die if you didn't do as they asked? I'd show them what a big mistake they'd made. Okay, those uh, wolves are still behind us, so let's uh, get this done here. Oh. Yep. Go on, just like I taught you. Oh, did I did I succeed? I think I did. Nice. I was worried I was targeting the uh, civilian. Let's go. Oh, we're guarding the wagon now. Okay. Dude, Dead Eye is a very sick feature. I can see you haven't lost your touch, Landon. Nobody said I had. You talk real big for a boy who couldn't shoot straight a half hour ago. And you talk big for an old man who can't stand up straight no more. You're a long way from being a Landon Ricketts partner, young, old, or otherwise. All those stories you heard before. Looks like that's all right. Come on, let's keep 
Oh no, I'm so sorry. So much oh, for this quiet life of yours, Mr. Ricketts. I didn't say I'd become a coward. I'm not gonna stand by and watch good people suffer. They've been beaten down for too long. I give them some hope. They don't know how lucky they are. Damn right they don't. My sour cast is the one with it. Can I still get my horse, the malnourished one, and leash him and sanu feed him sanu. back up? Nunca podré agradecer lo suficiente. Buy me a whiskey later, and we'll call things about even. I wonder how cheap ammo was back then. Current dead eye level three of three. Well, that's a patrol. I don't want to do that. So, what do we have for stores in this place? Do we have a gun store here, or is there? There's another landing. We got blackjack. We got a vacant property that I'll do. We got poker game and a general store. Let's go to the general store real quick. See what we can buy. Probably nothing useful for weapons wise, but. How are you, mister? Bueno, parece que usted sabe lo que busca. You can at least buy the maps available. I'll take that. What is this? Why is that for sale? I'll buy it. Why not? But... Un placer hacer negocios contigo. So these, are the, these are the horses you can buy. For uh, I, I still have the war horse one in my inventory that I think you just get. You can also buy them later on again. Kentucky Saddler. Wait, actually, now that I think about it, is the horse I'm trying to use right now one of these? One stars? Is that why it's so slow? That might be it. Oh, yes. Good, good. Make a look. Okay, piece of clothing. What does that mean? It says I can use it, but I don't want to use it if it's a one time use. Oh, okay, so it, no, it does say use it and it'll be added to your outfits. Oh, so you can ca kind of go camouflage since I got the bandito. I've discovered it at least. This is the one I want to do. I need to finish this one to get the deadly assassin. Need to complete American Appetites. I probably will, like I said, fast travel back at some point between parts uh, sometime soon. The other two aren't that hard to get, I think. This is just purchase that from Thieves Landing. I can do that because you can cheat with poker on that one. Um, search Solomon's Folly and purchase at the... Okay, yeah, I can do that one off camera too. Now, where is the Bandito? Oh, this one's tough. Defend residents, claim a bandito bounty alive. Liar's dice, night watch job. Yep. Well, that, that, it did say a night watch job, so that's this right here. I can go ahead and do that right now. On camera. I think we're going to call it here after I do this. We'll probably call it for this part anyways, so... Let's go ahead and do a night watch job and call it for this part. Any problems? Call me. I need to learn Spanish for this. All I knew was dog. So I can lasso. And hog tie. That only works if there's one of them. Because if, if there's two of them, I'm just going to go straight to shooting. Let's go to lasso first. Just in case. Hopefully, uh, wh whatever that dude, the other location down bottom, actually has a... Yeah. something. What, what do we hear? Get after him, boy! You want to get shot, friend? Hog tie. Or you're dead! Desátame ya! No quieras hacerme tu enemigo! Where's the dog? Okay, what do we got? There's one done. Honor 50. Nice. What happens when you max out honor? I need to find that out. 
Oh, that's local law enforcement picking up the b criminal. Okay, nice. Is there a fight going on? What do we got? Is there a brawl or what? We're going to capture both of them. Can I just lasso both of them? No, I think it, it's just scare them off at this point. More honor, I'll take it. What do we got, dog? It was literally just a, a freaking fight, straight up fist fight. <laughs> What else we got? Come on, give me more action. Dude, the, the dog's walk is kind of janky. I mean, same with John, looks like he has to take a crap. Hog tie this guy, okay, done. Wait, stop the thief. What thief? Oh, I think we're finished. I think I just turned this in. Okay. Yeah, I think we're done. There's the night watch. Oh, how much did you get paid for a night watch? $88. Oh my lord. For doing a night watch? That's a lot of money in this time. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> what? Forget being a, a bounty hunter or anything. Just do night watches every freaking time. That's insane money. That's ridiculous. Okay. What I was going to say is hopefully this is a town down here and they have a gun store. What other towns are available? Potentially one there. I don't know what, what whatever that place is. Train stop. Another settlement over there. Either way. Okay, this is where we're going to call it for this part. Uh, what? What? Did they, they had a property here, right? I'm going to go to that one real quick. And then we'll call it. I don't want to start the land in Ricketts accidentally. But I do want to get the vacant property. Make a save at this point. Is it a... Ooh, purchase for 200. I'll take it still. Mexican poncho menu entry. Oh, that's for another outfit. Okay. Well, this is what we're going to call it for this part. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave any feedback down below. And we'll see you guys next time. Take care.